Welcome to part two of Completely Random with Michelle Gressel as Michelle Rides the Joe. Proudly brought to you by Franchise Mart and the Residence Inn. Enjoy the ride. Waiting at the bus stop to get on the Joe. He's being green, riding his bike, and hopping on the Joe for his daily commute. Smart guy. Would you say the Joe's a good way to uh, be green and, and get your exercise when you ride your bike? Sure, it's a lot of fun to get on the bike in the morning and get your blood going before you get on the bus. And uh, how long does it take you to get your bike on and off the rack? About 10 seconds. Okay, you don't mind if I film you while you do that here in no, a second? No, real quick, two steps. Fabulous. Get on there and get on the bus. Well, here comes the bus. Let's see if Travis really can get his bike on in 10 seconds. One. We're timing Travis to see if he can do it in 10 seconds. Two. Three. Four. I'm doing slow seconds, just in case you can. Six. Seven. Eight. Eight and a half. Did it.
I do now. Okay, great. I'm I learning want, a lot. I want to interview this Mike Okay. Ryan. I wonder if he knows that coming. His name is Travis. Yes. Travis. Be careful, Travis. Why do you like writing the joke? Still made, are they made in China now? Probably. I have no idea where they're made. Yeah. <laughs> okay. How about, how about uh, talking to the uh, director of safety? We talked to him already. Did we? Okay, my memory's bad. Okay. I was just, get, why don't you ask him how well we're doing? How, how well our pilot is doing here? Did I break any safety rules? Absolutely not. You did wonderfully. Do you, you think people saw me okay? Absolutely. So you had another question asked. Thank you. I knew that. Completely random. Okay. What did you do before you worked for the show? I feel like I have an idea, but you have to tell me. Well, first you've got to give up what your idea is, and then I'll tell you. I think you were in the military. I have been in the military. Ding, yes. Ding 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 ding. I can spot them a mile away. Okay. What branch? Army. Corps of Engineers. Spent. Uh, uh. Four years in the service. Wow. Yeah. Well, thanks for your service. Spent a time in uh, Vietnam and came back as uh, a veteran of Bronze Star Wow. Thank you. Thank you. Very Thank large you. appreciation for anybody in the church. Now, what I did prior to this, uh -huh. 37 years in mechanical engineering business. Oh, you're one of those. <laughs> what do you do with that? <laughs> well, Primarily what I was involved in is uh, heating and air conditioning, design, build, and application. So anything and everything that has to do with heating and cooling, uh, I probably had a finger in it at some point. Were you like Schneider on uh, one day at a time? Or is it a good time? <laughs> one day at a time, yeah. Okay. Time. That's Did a great have, good memory. Did you have like a long thing of keys? And <laughs> No, that, that has a tendency to wear out your pants prematurely. So you did try that at one point? Well, <laughs> that's why they make tool belts. <laughs> did you drive before you became the yes. instructor? Okay. Yes. Um, I was, I was uh, I'm coming up uh, on my fourth anniversary in September, and I've been a road supervisor for about three years. So basically a year of driving prior to so you're a quick learner, obviously. Uh, very lucky. Okay, perfect. I have one more question, but I'm going to have to get by you. So. Okay. Just, this is how they do it on the Joe. Just squeeze by. Are you guys currently hiring? Are you always looking for drivers, or do you have a question to call? Oh, you're not currently hiring. No. You're full. We're full. In this economy, you're full. That's awesome. However, we have we have been hiring at a pretty good uh, clip up till uh, the first of the year, and we're in a little bit of uh, just kind of a, a plateau right now. So probably start of the school year, September, October, we may see an increase. Do you have to have a CDL for that? Yes. Commercial driver's license, class B. Air, air brake and passenger endorsements. I think you guys do need some Julie's and the love boat coming down through here. <laughs> <laughs> Michelle, if they did, how would Please they do no, it? <laughs> okay. What would you like? Would you like peanuts or pretzels? Absolutely. Oh. Well, we want to thank.
thank you guys for allowing us to film on the show today. Um, we're hoping that more people are more conscious about getting on the show, saving our environment, saving their bottom line for their budget, and uh, building a sense of community and using the Wi-Fi. Absolutely. And riding their bikes. Of all these uh, six people in here, who's been the most difficult to interview? You. <laughs> that would be counting seven. Okay. Okay, I won't put you on the spot with that question. No, everybody was great. Okay. Everybody was great. Okay. Well, I was going to say the IT guy. IT guys usually aren't very verbal. No, most of the time we're kind of quiet. I'm, I'm an exception to the rule. I think you did good. You've got good social skills. For an IT guy, you mean? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Very good. No, it's been a great experience. I did not know about the Wi-Fi, so I'm excited. I didn't know about the bulk passes where you could buy how many ten at a time, right. and with the discounts. Okay. okay. And do you have a route up Quivira that stops at Quivira 95? Uh, yes, we do. Two routes and stuff there, no park mall. Good. Actually, I have more than two that stop at the mall. So, if people wanted to walk across the street to Franchise Mart at 95th and Quivera, it would be quite convenient for them. Absolutely. Okay. Yeah. That was just an extra plug for. Route D, Route L. Uh, five, route 575 it goes from Waldo over in Kansas City, Missouri to uh, KU Edwards on Quivera. Stops at Johnson County Community College, no park mall. Do you know all the routes by their names and numbers? Uh, unfortunately, yes. <laughs> That's impressive. <laughs> I'd like to see you make a rap song out of the rap song. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, this, this. I'm sorry. Go ahead. This You're back on camera. Yeah, it's okay. Michelle gets mad if she's not on camera now. No, it's usually um, this part of my body, and I'm like, um, Brad, I'm down here. That's why I'm going down there. This concludes this week's edition of Completely Random with Michelle Russell. So, thanks, guys. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. We do blackmail if we can. Bye, Brad. Thank you for the ride. Yes, you're quite welcome. Very good ride. Enjoy it. Thank you. Michelle, I got an idea. What? Maybe you could swipe this bike. You know, I've been Travis looking. won't even notice. Go ahead and it only takes ten seconds to get it off. Uh, I don't know if you've seen me try to do that before. Well, let's try. Okay, one, go. Okay, we'll start again. One. Travis, I need your help. Two. You're burning. You're burning daylight. You pick that up and drop it down. Three. Yep. Yeah. And fold it, I think. Four. Five. Six. You did it in that ten seconds. Okay, we're probably not hearing any of this, but... Oh, there's no, directions. Fear, fear, fear. There's Get the one. Oh, pull handle to Two, stone out. Three. Pull hook out over tire. Front wheel here. Nobody told me to read the directions first. <laughs> they just said to do it. They probably weren't sure how competent you were as far as a reader goes. Okay. Because you did go to Pitt State. You're a gorilla after all. Thanks for being completely random with us today in writing with Michelle on the Joe.